What's up, YouTube, man? It's your boy, SVTJ, and I'm back with another banger video. Today, we're on our way to go pick up some E85 fuel pumps. The factory fuel pumps that are in the car, the Moses they out of there. So right now, I'm on my way to LMR, a late model restoration out there in Waco, Texas. Probably about like eh, three, four, three hour drive, I think. Yeah, three hour drive. Um, go head out there, pick up the fuel pumps, maybe some more goodies too. Uh, we're gonna be on E85 this time, guys, so I'm excited to see you know how the car runs if you haven't already man give this video a thumbs up man like comment and subscribe man because i'm back with another banger man come on bruh Jeez. oh shoot stopped at the big gas truck stop you feel me home and denny's and shit bro yes lord i don't think they take it to oh, fuck it i got okay i got a little i got a little special change you feel me yeah uh I, hey karen where the fuck are we we're in Bryan, Texas. Bryan, Texas, my boy. Bryan, Texas. That's, ooh. I would flip if I was a kid. Look at this, the RC cars, okay? Oh, okay, beer. EBT cover liquor, too? Huh? EBT cover on liquor? Did it did the other day. Yeah, I, the I am sick of the government. Oh, hello. Hey, I'm about to put y'all boys on, bro. The best, the best one you can buy, my nigga. Blackberry smash, bro. Yeah, remember that. Blackberry smash, but I'll put y'all on. It's the purple one. This is the only Negro that I know that's gonna tell a cashier to put 33. He said put 11 gallons on pump seven. I'm not gonna lie to y'all, boy. I'm starting to get fond of these Acris. And like, this might do for a good daily driver in the future one day. I'm loving those five spoke wheels. Hey, can y'all see those on the on the cover? Hey, can you see those on the cover? Maybe it's like the outlining was like red, probably, huh? With the red and the chrome? It's actually that looks a little bit bigger than the ones you already had on. Coyote swap. I actually think it's a Coyote Swap GT. I really think that is. That motherfucker nice though. You see the white rims on there? Yes. That motherfucker Fox body in a Damn. dog. Damn. Yeah. I told you we were saying something bad just happened. Yeah. yeah. All day. Where do I go? Uh, that's receiving. Uh, All right. Waco, Texas. Elder Mar. I wouldn't have had these screws in here. Yeah. This motherfucker would have came off. Most definitely. Oh my god, LSX. Then I really would have been Look at the LSX badge. Sexy, Sexy understatement, bro. Look at the Fox. Really some interesting cars over here. Most definitely. Fuck. Wheel call pickup. Huh? Wait. How does this work? All right. I'm pretty sure we're supposed to go in there. Oh, excuse me. I got you, wait. Bro. Excuse me. Um, I'm here to pick up uh, fuel pumps. I need to order some rims from here. <laughs> we should be getting a lot of them back in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm missing my other SVT rim. Well, the two fronts. Oh, three covers? Yeah. Sheesh. Yes, sir. Yeah, we're missing some of the wheels because we're getting ready for our uh, cruise in weeks. Cruise? What do you mean? Uh, we're, we do, before COVID, we're doing it every year, but uh, this is our first year back. We do, uh, you know where that NASCAR track is up in uh, Denton area? We Maybe? both wouldn't know, because yeah, we're, we're, we're in, from, from Houston. Oh, okay, gotcha, yeah. gotcha. So <laughs> if you go up to Fort Worth and go up to Denton, the NASCAR Texas Motor Speedway, I think is what it's called, mm -hmm. um, it's going to be October... We, we used to do it at the uh, NS racetrack, the quarter mile track, but they were booked this year, so we did it at this one. Here, I'll bring it up for you guys. You guys should make it up. It's a, 
We do lots, lots of free stuff. We give away wheels. We give out what? Yeah. Like the uh, the uh, like. Not like it's like a giveaway or is it? Yeah, like we just do giveaway. We could do okay. a ton of giveaway. This is for like customer appreciation. Uh, oh, okay. Look at look it up on Facebook. That's what it's mm -hmm. gonna look like. Look like it's called Ella Mark Cruiser. Yeah, yeah. Take a picture of it, man. That's sick. I'm most definitely. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. I'll be That's I'll be working sick. in the uh, booth, so you just you guys come look for me and say hi. Cause I'll what's your name? Uh, Neil. Neil? Neil? Yeah, That's I do all of our uh, customer tech and help over there. Our, our normal guys up here is out today. This so. is not what I expected M LMR to look like. First time coming up here. Anyway. It's it's a little smaller. Most people are expecting. We used but, to have a showroom that had cars showroom. and everything, wow. but. Uh, it's a little easier just to do a pickup because people will start looking at cars. Thank you, Thank you man. Right. Yeah, bro. I can come up there and just get a free set of wheels, bro. Exactly. I yeah, can come up yeah. there and get a free yeah, Whipple. Like, yeah, bro, just come see me. Yeah, I, can... I sent you his name. His name is Neil. I don't know how to Most definitely. We got our fucking 340 LPH Yo, pumps. Is nice. Yes. Big, big, nice Fox body, bro. Fox body? That's what they call it? Yeah, it's a bug body. That motherfucker is cool as hell. We here with Kai. Yeah, we here with Kai. Uh, so far, got the jack up under there. He jacked the car up, and everything right here is pretty much short, sweet, and simple. We ended up getting the first strap off. This was way simpler than I could ever imagine for it to be. Um, we got the first strap out. Of course, obviously, you want to make sure that you disconnect everything electrical that's up under here. It's really only like two or three things, two or three harnesses that you have to disconnect. After that, it's smooth selling from here. You guys, so let's fast forward. We got the pumps in, and now we just go through the process of putting everything back together. All right, gang. Several hours later, man, I actually end up installing the fuel pump. Um, when we got the fuel pumps in, you know, before I had put everything together or before I had bolted shit up, um, I wanted to make sure that I heard the fuel pumps, you know, turn and wind on and they wasn't at first. So what I had to do was I had to get this. Um, I had traced and wired everything down from the common ground. It turns out there was a short, a shortage somewhere with the booster pump that was hooked up. I ended up hooking that and hooking these two together and testing the shit out some more. And now we got power, you know what I'm saying? Consistent, good power. I'm gonna give you guys a first startup. Just gonna do a rundown, gonna look over everything, make sure, you know, everything is all right. Nothing's, you know, he you don't want no messes. All right, so here we are, guys. First, first hand. Yeah, start it, come start. All right, guys, end up putting tail lights in. Gonna get a first start. Prime it, prime it. That's when you press the gas? No, that's when you just turn the key on and off until you see the pressure gauge build up to uh, 30 PSI. Turn it on and off. Where's it at now? I can't see it. It's at 45. It's at 45? Yeah. Good. You ready? Yeah. Are you sure? Positive. Uh, 
Okay guys, get ready. right here if you are new to the channel man get this video a thumbs up man like comment and subscribe because we got some more banger videos coming to you yes we finna swap this supercharger blower we finna go get a redyno tune and we finna see if we make some more power but yeah man without further ado we are out this zone Woo!